Nissan model 4040 uh, glass cabinet. It's a fairly good sized cabinet. The dimensions on the outside are 40 inches wide by 40 inches deep. It is approximately 60 inches in all. Uh, it comes with a light fixture that's not mounted on it, but mounted prior to shipping. Um, the cabinet is 16 gauge steel and uh, with 12 gauge legs. It's all steel welded construction. And then we uh, paint it with a, a very thick powder coat to assemble it. This, this unit has two ways to access the, the cabinet. It's basically a flip top unit. The whole top of the unit opens up with gas springs, which goes uh, with the heavy top. You do it with one arm. And then there's a large side door on the right hand side of the cabinet. It's also a very large door, so you can put fairly large parts in here. The side door is basically 28 inches by 18 inches tall. And you've got the visibility of the gas shocks. The gun system on this unit is operated with a push pedal. With a gun for a 14 CF hump ceramic. 14 CF this. Foot pedal comes with the unit, of course. The supply air from your compressor <coughs> goes to the right side of the foot pedal. From the left side, the supply air to the cabinet goes from the left side of the foot pedal to the safety valve. And you can see the plunger here on the top of the unit. It presses the safety valve and allows the gun to shoot. When this top is open, you cannot blast this unit. Uh, to load the unit with media, you don't need any more than 15 to 20 pounds of media at a time. We recommend glass beads, uh, aluminum oxide, blasting garnet, and silicon carbide. You cannot use uh, metal blast materials, uh, metal shot, or metal grit. The system isn't built for that. Um, and then we also highly avoid uh, advise against using this sand in itself because of the health hazard. When the unit, uh, when the abrasives in the unit have yeah, pretty well been abused and they don't work very well anymore. It, it, at the bottom of the hopper there's a little easy flip cap. You just release the latch, <coughs> dump the material into the pail, and clip it back up. That's all, that's all there is for that. The window is 25 by 10 inch plexiglass on the inside of the unit, stuck to the inside of the unit is a, a peel off mylar shield which is replaceable when it gets frosted up so that you don't blast into the plexiglass window. Those are replaceable. We offer a 12 pack with the sticker tape already applied. Again, the electrical assembly is, is already mounted before we ship the unit. It doesn't have to be on this unit. But it's a box on top. It's got a, two receptacles for LED lighting. And then on the back of the electrical box, there's a receptacle that you can plug the dust collector into. And that way, the dust collector goes on and off with the unit as you use it. This unit comes with our DC-1500 dust collector. It has two filters, a bag filter in the bottom, and in the top there's a cartridge filter that, that filters out the fine material before it goes through the motor. It's very important to keep the dust collector in the bag, the cartridge filter clean after extensive use. Take the bag outside, shake it out real good, take the cartridge filter out and blow it out with air, but it's very important to keep this unit clean. And every once in a while, when you've got a lot of dust inside the cabinet, it doesn't hurt to blow through the air around for a while and it goes without.